Hi, everybody. Welcome to Early Childhood Corner, sponsored by Catherine G. McGovern and McGovern Foundation. My name is Jacob, and this is... Ziggy. Ziggy. And today, our activity is one of my favorites. It's going to be building a small world and then playing with a small world. And basically what a small world is, is a small world uh, that you can build inside a tray. So we got our little tray here or a pot or a pan or anything that, you know, contains objects. Um, so we're going to build a little world inside of here. And what we're going to build it with is, uh, well, we have several different things. So I'll just kind of talk about those. Um, we have some like bark and uh, other sticks that we have found on nature walks. Um, also found on nature walks are some rocks and we even have some tiles we've found uh, and some moss that we were able to find for, from our nature walks. Um, outside of that, we also have some aquarium, uh, aquarium plants. Do we have a bag? Yeah, and we have these toys that so we're gonna play with these toys. Um, and we have some little mushrooms that we painted, little wooden mushrooms. Uh, some water beads that are kind of uh, blue that we can put in to make a little ocean or lake or pond or river or whatever you want to make. Cinnamon sticks, uh, if you can't find any good sticks, which I don't know why you wouldn't be able to, there's sticks everywhere, but cinnamon sticks also make kind of cool looking logs. Uh, and then these are little peach pits um, from eating peaches. So if you save your peach pits, you can use them for a small world. And the way we make it, how do we make a small world, Ziggy? We just start putting stuff in here and building the world. So we can just go ahead and get started. You wanna work with me, Zig? All right, so here is our small world. And now you might be asking yourself, what do you do with a small world once you have built it? Well, we brought a couple little frogs, an octopus, and a bird. So we have some things that we can play with in our small world. It's a great thing to make it's fun to kind of build together, to go on nature walks and find the things for it. But once you're done with it, it's also a really fun thing to do some imaginary play with. Um, so you want to do some play? All right. I'm going to be the frog. Damn it. I'm going to be a mommy frog. Oh, hi. Hi. What are you doing? I am mommy frog. Come on, our town. All right, let's go to the town. Where are we going? Yes, it's some plants. Okay. okay. Um, 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 um. <gasps> ah, there's an octopus! Mommy, the octopus got me! The octopus got me! Oh, thank you. Hey, I was just trying to tell you not to fall in the water. I'll be the bird. Go! Don't go! Come back! What are you doing? Come on the, on the ocean. But I'm a bird, I fly in the sky, I don't go in the ocean. No, we eat pants. Um, 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 so um. yummy. I'm going to eat the ocean and the pants. Do it, octopus. All right, that is our activity. This is our small world. We're going to keep playing, but thank you for joining us again. My name is Jacob, and this is... Ziggy. Ziggy, and this has been Early Childhood Corner, sponsored no, by Catherine G. McGovern and McGovern no, Foundation. Be the baby Bye, everybody. Bye.